I think GME here at Memorial is a long time coming and I'm so excited to see graduate medical education take hold and uh, establish itself here in uh, our health system. We are well poised to uh, create one of the best GME training programs in the country. This is an outstanding, growing, very large public health system that has the expertise and the talent to really run GME well. The first three programs that we uh, are planning and have applied for are the uh, pediatric residency program, which is a three-year program, a physical medicine and rehabilitation program, which is a four-year program, and an internal medicine program, which is a three-year program. Those programs, uh, assuming uh, that we get approval, uh, would start in July of 2017. A lot of people in the country recognize the need for graduate medical education to reform itself and essentially keep up with the tremendous changes that are going on in payment and delivery system reform in, uh, in the country. So GME has to keep up with that and I think that my philosophy here uh, in general and for Memorial in particular is that we do exactly that, that we create new training programs that help our community and the country train physicians so they can work in new delivery systems, new payment systems, and really advance uh, medical care for our community here in uh, South Florida. So I've always had a strong um, passion for uh, the science of medical education and training physicians in newer training models so that they can work in newer uh, delivery systems here in the country. We're really moving uh, from being a purely community-based healthcare system into being a community-based independent academic medical center. And uh, make no mistake about it, Memorial is now an academic medical organization. We have already achieved approval from the ACGME as uh, an institution that can pursue residency programs. Uh, historically, we have had a uh, significant volume of medical students, nursing students, pharmacy students and residents, and, and other ancillary personnel. But this will be the first time in the history of this organization that we will be running our own residency programs. So these will be memorial residents. And uh, these programs will be large. So we're not talking about having four or five or six uh, residents uh, in a particular discipline. When all is said and done, we'll have around 200 residents uh, here at Memorial. So students here, uh, particularly in South Florida, have a need for residency spots. South Florida, relative to the rest of the country, has fewer residency spots. We rank about 42 out of 50 states in terms of number of residency spots to train uh, students after they graduate from medical school. So we are fulfilling a public health need here by creating more uh, slots. But Memorial in particular is uh, well poised to run GME for several reasons. Number one, it's a very large public health system. We are one of the largest in the nation, um, including our six uh, hospitals and a, and, a, and a growing outpatient uh, physician practice. So we have the expertise, we have the technical expertise, we can do everything from basic primary care all the way up to very advanced tertiary and quaternary care in our uh, hospitals and our health system. Uh, so that's number one, we have, we have the talent, we have the faculty, we have the medical staff who can uh, run these clinical programs and train young doctors well. You have uh, a tremendous volume of cases, uh, interesting cases, your physicians are excellent. You have predominantly board certified physicians on your staff. Uh, the institution is a wonderful institution to work in. And uh, South Florida is a, a great place to live. So here at Memorial, because GME is new to our uh, leadership, to our medical staff, to our 
uh, nursing colleagues, we have the ability to create training programs that align really well with the way we deliver care, to create teams that are truly multidisciplinary and functional, and you don't have to fight a a very long history in a, in a culture that's set in a, in a certain way of doing things. We get to try new things and I think we get to fix some of the wrongs that have accumulated over time in GME throughout the country. And for that reason I think it's a really exciting time to be um, a trainee here in this health system and uh, try to do things in a way that's an improvement upon the existing models of training that are out there.